With all the information floating around about coronavirus, Tallahassee Memorial Healthcare is ready to set the record straight. I'm Dr. Andrea Frial, Chief Medical Officer here at Tallahassee Memorial Healthcare. So coronavirus is a respiratory virus originally named from the crown-like spikes of the virus, similar to viruses such as MERS or SARS, and it is contracted through respiratory droplets. The number one way to help protect yourself is to properly wash your hands. And that sometimes um, means about 20 seconds of actually using soap and water on those hands. Um, the next way is also to properly cough into your sleeve or away from others. If you use a tissue, please uh, properly dispose of that in the waste basket, basket and then also wash your hands again. Stay home if you're sick. That is imperative to helping avoid spreading um, respiratory illnesses. Please also avoid touching your mucous membrane, such as your eyes and your mouth with your hands. That will help prevent the spread of disease. Although there's not a 100% guarantee that using hand sanitizer will help protect you from the coronavirus, if you do not have the ability to properly wash your hands, and again, remember that's for about 20 seconds of hand washing, and sanitizer is available, that is still an effective means to minimize germs. Currently, there's no treatment for the coronavirus. We do supportive measures to um, help you stay healthy, and otherwise, at this time, they're working on um, antivirals for vaccination, but there currently is not a treatment. For the general public, it is not necessary for everyone to wear a mask to protect yourself from getting coronavirus. The specific need for wearing a mask is when you are in direct contact with the patient who has the disorder. Using masks unnecessarily can cause shortages and lead to misinformation. So that myth we really do need to dispel. The CDC does not recommend using currently a mask to help prevent yourself from getting the coronavirus. So the reason that you may actually encounter or need to use a mask is if, if you are yourself sneezing or show signs of a respiratory illness and you're going in to be evaluated, then surely using a mask um, in an open public place is appropriate at that time. Yes, it is still safe to receive a letter or package from China or other countries at this time. Using hand dryers is not an effective means to killing the coronavirus. You may encounter hand dryers in public places like a movie theater. However, you should still properly wash your hands, towel dry them, and dispose of the towel properly. So garlic is a healthy food that many people ingest and take on a regular basis, but it is not shown to reduce your risk of transmission for coronavirus. Currently, Tallahassee Memorial has adequate supply of the PPE or the personal protective equipment required to take care of patients who would have coronavirus, tuberculosis, and other illnesses. This includes face shields, masks such as the N95 mask, the proper gown, and gloves. And again, hand washing stations and sanitizer to help protect our colleagues. So TMH, as this situation is continuously evolving, continues to closely monitor and work with our community, as well as the Florida Department of Health, the CDC, and the World Health Organization to properly screen and evaluate patients in our region. We have continued to institute protocols that we have in place for these types of emergencies and will continue to add information for our colleagues patients as well as the medical staff. The situation is changing continuously, so please make sure that you receive your information from the CDC, the World Health Organization, or the Florida Department of Health. To find out what TMH is doing and to get your information from a local source, please visit us at tmh.org coronavirus.